Well, I hope you're enjoying these videos. We now have a J.D. Crow 2006 Blackjack, and I want to tell you something. These banjos are extraordinarily rare and extraordinarily hard to get, and I just happen to have one. So uh, we'll play it. They sound great, and uh, here we go. <laughs> songs all over the place just to, so you can hear the different registers uh, so th what uh, the J.D. Crow Blackjack is unique because number one it has a uh, J.D. Crow ring in it okay number two it's copper flashed okay and that gives a different ta uh, sound and it's mahogany okay most of the time you see the this gold look with uh, curly maple. Okay, so J.D. Crow really liked this combination of uh, the, the copper flashing, which is like gold, and the mahogany sound. So here's what it looks like. And you'll also see that all the parts are engraved. The tailpiece has engraving, the armrest, and we'll turn it to the side and even do a close-up. And this is somewhat rare because Gibson uh, only engraved tone rings, which you can see this one's engraved on all their really high-end, really fancy models. So this has an engraved uh, tone ring, and you can go up the uh, fingerboard, and this is an actual Gibson pattern, uh, but Gibson changed their patterns as they went into production, made them simpler. So this is a historic Gibson pattern, which is very complicated. And we'll turn it over, and here we have the keys. And what you'll notice is this was uh, professionals uh, made this into a speed neck, okay? And what that does, that really lets you play the uh, banjo fast, hence the word speed neck. And once again, that, that costs to get somebody to do that right is, is an extra expense. All right, so we open the banjo, and uh, of course, you see the resonator right here. I'm into resonators today for some reason. Banjo's in really good condition. And uh, we have the Gibson Master Tone label. And they started putting these in at about 2004 because you'll see different labels and different Gibsons. And you have J.D. Crow sign this banjo. Isn't that wild? Look at that really nice signature. Okay. So. These banjos, as I say, are extraordinarily rare. So if you need any information, you can call me at 404-218-8580 or Andy at 404-372-5482. And if you want to come in and visit us anytime, seven days a week, and call us because we may be out looking for banjos. Uh, I know a lot of you have sky miles. We've had people fly into the airport. We pick you up, spend four, four five, six hours, whatever you want to spend play these banjos compare so, so you're going well what's the difference between this and a regular jd crow well we have both of them so you can compare them you can compare this with a uber compare it with a stelling compare it with a free pre-war whatever you want and when you get done you'll be able to tell what the different banjos are what they sound like 
And I don't know any place in the United States where you can do this. And I talk to people all the time who bought five or six banjos because they're looking for that sound. And had they been able to compare them, obviously, you know, one or two of the five or six would be their favorites. So now they've got to resell three or four banjos that, that uh, you know, that aren't as, that don't like as well as their favorite. But anyway, so hopefully this, this will help you to uh, better learn what the different models sound like. So you guys have a great day and uh, play some banjo today.